Welcome back. Today we're going to explore the WooCommerce UPS Live Rates free plugin by Octalize, a powerful and free tool that integrates UPS real-time shipping rates directly into your WooCommerce store just for free. What are Live Rates plugin? Let's start with a closer look at what Live Rates plugin really is. Unlike flat or fixed shipping rates, Live Rates plugins connect your online store directly with shipping carriers like for example, UPS, FedEx, USPS or DHL via their APIs. This connection allows the plugin to fetch up-to-date shipping prices dynamically, considering factors such as the weight and size of the package, the destination address, and even the shipping service selected. This means your customers get real-time precise shipping costs every time they check out. No guessing, no surprises. If you would like to learn more about what affects rates, check out our blog. Table Rate versus Live Rates Understanding the difference between table rates and live rates is essential for WooCommerce shipping. So, in a nutshell, table rates are basically manually set shipping method, where the store owner defines fixed rates based on different conditions. An example of such a product is our flexible shipping plugin, which is primarily based on table rate rules. If you'd like to learn more about this product, we invite you to watch our other videos. Extra hint, recently we added an AI feature to our main plugin, Flexible Shipping, which makes setting up these rules even easier and faster. On the other hand, live rates are pulled directly from the shipping carrier system in real time. This means prices are always accurate, reflecting current surcharges and other variables. So which plugins are better? The answer is, neither, it all depends on your shipping needs and how much control you want over your shipping costs. How to configure UPS Live Rates plugin. Configuring the UPS Live Rates plugin is simple, and I'll guide you through it step by step. First, download plugin files from the WordPress plugin search section or WordPress repository. You can find the plugin easily by typing UPS Octalize plugin in both places. Next, install and activate the plugin from your WordPress dashboard or via FTP. If you don't know how to do it, feel free to watch the video on our channel or read the tutorial on the blog. Then, hit the button Settings. Enter your connection credentials. If you do not have a UPS account, we invite you to follow our step-by-step -step guide to create an account and obtain the necessary accesses. Important note, we recommend using authorization type, client credentials. This setting will ensure the greatest stability of the connection. Here, we also have the option of setting a custom origin. If you want the sending address to be different from the one set in the main WooCommerce settings, you can enter it here. The last section is Advanced Options. Select here the measurement units according to your UPS account settings. Debug mode will be explained in the troubleshooting section of this video. Next, go to WooCommerce Settings Shipping. Here, you need to either add or select an existing shipping zone that matches your delivery regions. Add UPS shipping method to selected shipping zone. Then, go inside UPS shipping method. Go through each section and set it up according to your intentions and UPS account settings. Remember that with each setting, you have a hint that will explain what the setting means. Start by setting the title method. I, for example, will call this method UPS shipping. The access points option has three options to choose from. In the pro version of the plugin, a full list of pickup points is available, along with a point finder on the order page. In the free version of the plugin, one pickup point closest to the shipping address is displayed on the order page. Fallback is a backup shipping cost. Free shipping is a useful tool for increasing the value of your customer's shopping cart. The UPS Services parameter allows you to enable or disable UPS services. You can also sort them using these three horizontal lines. Negotiated rates enable this option if you want to use the negotiated rates assigned to your account. If not selected or your UPS agreement doesn't include assigning the discounted rates to your account, the standard rates will be used by default. Insurance If you want to include shipment insurance in the shipment amount, check this option. Pickup type allows to set the pickup type of your shipping. It may affect the live rates. You can choose the pickup type which suits your needs best from the following list. In most cases selecting the customer counter or one-time pickup grants the most accurate rates. If the not set option has been chosen, the pickup type value will not be sent in the UPS API request, which might also result in getting the more accurate rates returned in some cases. 
The last option allows you to enable the adjustment table known from Table Rates plugins, such as flexible shipping. Take a look at our video to learn more about the possibilities of this option. Finally, save your settings. From now on, your WooCommerce store will display real-time UPS shipping rates to your customers, based on their exact orders. How to turn on UPS labels. Turning on UPS labels in WooCommerce is easy and convenient. You can enable this feature by purchasing an additional plugin that integrates seamlessly with the free or pro version of the UPS plugin, or as a bundle with the pro version. Once activated, you'll be able to generate and manage UPS shipping labels directly from within WooCommerce, without having to leave your dashboard. This makes the process faster and more efficient for managing your shipments. This add-on will expand your store with new and interesting features, which you can learn about on our product page. Troubleshooting If you run into any issues or unexpected results, don't worry, we're here to help. First, it's worth mentioning that we constantly update and expand our documentation every week, adding new content to make finding solutions easier than ever. We highly recommend checking it out whenever you encounter problems, you'll often find the answer ready for you. Another significant worth mention thing is the debug mode. This tool is built into every one of our plugins and serves as the primary way to quickly and effectively diagnose issues when they arise. Using debug mode can save you a lot of time and help resolve problems faster. Troubleshooting, no shipping options available. One of the most common errors with any shipping plugin is the message. There are no shipping options available or no shipping options are available for this address. Please verify the address is correct or try a different address. If you see this, here are the usual causes. A mismatch between your store currency and your UPS account currency. UPS services unavailable for the specific shipping and delivery addresses. Incorrect or incomplete UPS shipping credentials. Exceeded weight or dimension limits for the selected shipping method. Shipping options or services not properly configured in the plugin settings. Network or API connection issues between WooCommerce and UPS. In such cases, it's a good idea to enable the debug mode we mentioned earlier. This will show detailed information in the cart or checkout about why the shipping method isn't working. If you don't see debug info right away, you can trigger it by changing the cart contents or temporarily modifying the shipping address. If you don't see an error message when you turn debug mode on, there's a good chance that, for example, the service is unavailable. If this is the case, you should go to the UPS website, log in and check what services are available for the shipment and whether you have them enabled on UPS. Troubleshooting, rates discrepancy. If you notice a difference in shipping rates, the first step is to log into the UPS rate calculator and enter the same package dimensions, sender, and recipient details as in WooCommerce. Compare the rates shown there with what your plugin displays. Minor differences are normal because the UPS calculator and the plugin provides an estimate, not an exact match. However, if the discrepancies are significant, it's a good idea to review your shipping method settings in WooCommerce, especially the rates adjustment section. Adjusting these settings can help minimize the differences and ensure the rates shown in your store are as close as possible to the actual UPS charges. Troubleshooting, other errors. If you see an error followed by a code or number, it usually means there's an external API error coming from UPS. To learn more about these errors, we invite you to check our documentation, where we explain the most common UPS error codes, what they mean, and how to fix them. If you found our free WooCommerce UPS Live Rates plugin helpful, we're confident you'll love the Pro version even more. The Pro version unlocks powerful features designed to streamline your shipping process and boost your store's efficiency. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or need help, feel free to leave a comment below. We're always happy to assist. See you next time.